And longtime established aldermen also had their jobs on the line tonight. Many of them, voters in 15 wards, went to the polls. Of those 15, 11 aldermen were being challenged. 40th Ward Alderman Patrick O'Connor is facing a challenge from Andre Vasquez. O'Connor is the second longest serving alderman in city council. He took over Ed Burke's chairmanship of the finance committee. He ran against Vasquez, a newcomer to Chicago politics and a democratic strategist. Here we can see with all precincts reporting, Vasquez with the win, 54%. And the night team's Charlie DeMar is with the Vasquez campaign. Charlie, what's the word there? Uh, guys, it is a huge party here in Anderson Villas. This is a historic upset, potentially the upset of this election as Pat O'Connor has held this seat, has held the 40th Ward Alderman since 1983. He's the second longest serving alderman in Chicago, but no more tonight is about Andre Vasquez, a, a newcomer, as you mentioned, Erica, off the top. We know that he holds a day job as a manager at AT&T, adding a new title as 40th Ward Alderman. We came together to fight for affordable housing, for open and transparent government, and for a city that devotes its resources to its people, not the corporations, not the private developers, and we won. When the gap began to widen, not conceding, but he was well aware that his time was likely up. I don't know that this is going to be the party that it was in 1983, but I know that it's the party it's going to be in 2019. So thanks very much. And Vasquez, a Democratic Socialist, says he was inspired to make this run from Bernie Sanders when he made his presidential run back in 2016. This race was very much what we saw in the mayoral race, a very much a change versus experience and change won out here in the 40th Ward. We are live in Andersonville. Charlie DeMar, CBS 2 News. All right, Charlie, thank you.